I recently came across a photo on my social media feed by a sculptor named Daniel Popper called Hollow. It's a woman's torso. She's ripping her chest wide open. And in the picture I saw, um, a small child was uh, walking right through it. This image struck a really deep chord with me. I felt it in my body like I was ripping my insides wide open, like the space where my heart should be and everything it should hold was just absent, an absence of self, an absence of identity, and like anyone could just walk right through me, like I held no substance. The questions I've been asking myself and answering for myself are what is, what is in this space? Who is in this space and who am I in this space? This exploration started for me a long time ago uh, with the writing of the song that I'm going to play for you tonight. It's called Ask. I call it my personal declaration of independence. I wrote it at a time when I was at the height of my fame. Rusted Root had just gone triple platinum. My life was a whirlwind of cross-country tours and my developing family. New motherhood was all-encompassing, and rock stardom was a vortex of non-stop traveling and logistics and outward attention to the needs of everyone around me. On this day, my two-year-old son was in the bathtub. I was sitting at a desk nearby and watching him play and feeling like the tiniest bug trapped in this huge web that was dictating the course of my life. And it was a great life. I had fame, I had a beautiful child, an amazing partner, and together he and I were building the businesses which would become Mr. Small's theater and Mr. Small's recording studio. But there was so much more that I wanted to be, to do. I had just stumbled miraculously into everything in my life, but as a support character, as a backup singer, a percussionist, an ass shaker. <laughs> but I had desires and aspirations to build my own self. I had songs in me that had no exp expression, layers and layers of emotion with no clarity, a whole deep chasm of life brewing inside of me that needed to come out and see the light of day. The realization I had in that moment was that I had been waiting to be shown, to be led, to be invited. And this is where I was led, an amazing place, a full and beautiful life, but with no space for me to truly express myself. This realization in that moment was like the eye of a storm. And for the first time, I could clearly see that if I was ever going to do anything truly for myself or be anything that I wanted to be for myself, I had to fucking do it right then. No waiting for the right time. No waiting for the right circumstances or an invitation or a leader. I had to lead myself putting whatever small amounts of time I could find into prioritizing my needs, my expression, to creating, to learning, to asking for guidance that I needed, to finding the tools to do the things, to doing for myself, by myself. We as girls and women, we were never taught this. I as a human never saw that this is my right and the only true way to work towards knowing and expressing myself until that day. And the days, months, and years after that have become an ongoing process of redefining, rediscovering, and intentionally creating my best reality. This process never ends. I'm still doing it today. One foot in front of the other. Any step I can take at any moment, no matter how tiny, as the chorus of the song that I'm about to play for you says, you can say a prayer for what you really want. You can say it all night long. But if you never get your feet marching out the door and start walking, walk towards your life. Can't believe it, you mean All I had to do was ask I can't believe it, life is moving through me way too fast I can't believe it, you mean All I had to do was ask And now my life has shifted And 
Now my life has changed in way too many ways To leave me wanting to go the other way All my life I've asked and on and on we pray So pick up your pieces, go your own way Won't you come and slap me, yeah And tell me that I'm chicken shit Come and rock my boat You know I really need to take a swim Who am I talking to? I must be talking to myself Cause this is not your purpose No, this is not yours You can say a prayer for what you really want You can Thank you so very much.